Hey, what's up, guys? I am reviewing one of uh, my favorites compact carries, uh, concealed carry weapons, uh, and that is the Springfield XDS. I have it in the 45 caliber because that's the caliber I prefer with all my handguns, and we did, are making sure that it is not loaded. This is a subcompact firearm, and they even mark on the side that it is 3.3 inches, so it is small. You know, the uh, Springfield XD series it actually does have a subcompact that is a three inch barrel, so even shorter than this one, but this one's make is really easy to do a concealed carry with, and it's a, also a good travel weapon. Here in Texas, uh, there's almost nowhere that you can go where you can't have a firearm in your vehicle, and if you are a concealed carry, uh, there's a lot of places you can carry, and this is one that makes it very convenient. Uh, you can conceal really any firearm, it's just this one's easier a lot of the time. And it's a single stack, that's why it's so thin. If you look at this magazine, it's kind of like that 1911 one that I have. And when I do a video over my XD, that's uh, a four inch, you're gonna notice the difference because it's not single stack like that. Um, with a subcompact, you do sacrifice a couple of things. You sacrifice accuracy, and you do sacrifice the number of rounds that you can carry. And this is the uh, subcompact. This is not the extended magazine, so you can see it's, you know, only comes to where the grip does. The grip extender only adds an extra round. And so that's five shots. Uh, the other one has six. Alright, so this one's still pretty new. I had one a while back, and but this is a new one. And it locks back very easily. To take it apart, to take it down, you flip this lever up and you pull the trigger and it'll send the slide forward. It's easier for me to show you on the XD when I do that video, so if you want to know how to take this one apart, watch the XD video that will come out later. Same method. This switch will send it home. Now, unlike my 1911, this has no hammer. It has no cock lock feature. This is double action only, and the trigger is different that's a safety feature there you have to pull this and then you can pull the rest of the trigger and eventually it'll fire that is a feature of the XD and the XDS on both when there is a round chamber there is a bar right there you can kind of see the outline of it that'll come up just added features so you know if it's chambered or not the magazine release is ambidextrous and it is the same on the 1911 and like the 1911 it has a grip safety. One nice feature about the XDX is that you can change the back grip to make it fit your hand better and the first one I got came with a holster, a mag holster and it came with the high capacity mag or two high capacity mags and a regular mag. Um, this one did not. It came with the extra mags, but no holster or mag holster. This is a XDS holster. It is retention, means the only thing that's keeping it in there is this Allen screw. You can set it to how loose or how tight you want it, but with retention you just grab and pull. I'm not in law enforcement and that it's fine if I'm wanting to carry external but didn't come with it. They were running promotion that gave me extra more mags. I think I have six mags for this now. It did send me the holster and the mag holster. I still had these from my other one so now I have doubles 
but this is the XDS in the 45 caliber, the 3.3 length. Subscribe, like, and share. Check out my next video. It will be the XD45 when it comes to my firearm videos. So my next firearm video is going to be the big brother of this one. So stay tuned for that one. Springfield XD in the 4 inch. This was the XDS in the 3.3. Again, like, subscribe, and share. Leave comments. And I appreciate y'all tuning in to Red Dirt Outdoors.